In this video, we're going to be looking at how we can use the feature in Power Project to chase the logic and track the logic in your program. So I have here a simple sample project. I've got a number of tasks and links that go through. And also you have to normally select those links. You can see those to highlight and select the task. Um, but before I select the task, what I can do is I can open up our file task properties and go to the links tab. Now, if that's not appearing, Normally, you might find that you're not seeing it here. Just use the More button, which you see there. Click on Links. And if you want to keep this bar and task properties at the bottom, just pin that down so it always stays at the bottom. You can increase the height, you can reduce it if you need be. Now I've got that selected, I can select the task. And as I select the task, I can see the predecessor task and successor task next to each other. And if I want to track that, I can choose one of these items and just double click on it. And as I double click on it, you'll see a highlight in orange is previous and I can double click to chase it through. But you'll also notice that the links themselves are being highlighted in orange and that path I followed is remembered. So as I go back, I can see which ones I track back to and I can track back and forth and go through there and I can see which ones were in the path I was tracking as I go through. So a very quick and easy way to track your logic. If I want to, as soon as I click over here and deselect anything, that tracking has been has been lost. And you're back to normal. Again, now I can start tracking again from another point and following the logic through the program as I wish to.